Alright guys, welcome back to more Pokemon Adventures Red Chapter. So last episode, we got ourselves through Viridian Forest and we ran into this weird Pikachu that was running around that we kind of got forced to capture, I guess. Uh, now we're going to give it a nickname. Also, Cursor, move out of the way, please. Uh, I got a nickname, though. I got a pretty good nickname, I think. We're going to call him Virgil. And if you know what that was a reference to, then you're a nerd, just like me. Alright. So we got two Pikachus. <laughs> Right now. Wait, fucking level 5? Horse shit level 5. This thing was in level 13 when I caught it. I'm calling fucking bullshit on that. Oh, he's holding a light ball. That makes me kind of want to use him. It's a speed boost. Huh. Interesting. Alright, it's kind of weird that this guy gave, like, all these Pokemon, like, all these kind of, like, unique abilities. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna deposit this peak. God damn it. I'm going to deposit the one I caught. I can't speak. Deposit the Pikachu that I captured in the forest because it's not got a nickname. And this one has a light bulb, so screw it, why not? I'm going to keep it. I'll keep it in my team now. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it, but I'll, I'll let it just kind of hang out. Maybe, maybe I'll use it later at some point, but right now let's just, you know, chill. So yeah, let's uh, explore Pure City. See what the hell's going on with this place. Brock is a rock. His his bellow is strong and long. His name is full of fame. Fucking Jesus, man. <laughs> God damn. Fucking just wow. That was terrible. Alright. Uh, okay, so this literally just takes us up here. That's the guy that can teleport us. What's up here? Oh, the museum. This is interesting. Is that. Oh, God, there's a fucking Pidgeot just hanging out. It's a Pokemon Foss. Hello, the boss wants me to get rid of this fossil. Right, well, give me it then. I want it. Give me it. Isn't this the old amber? Ah, oh, fucking goddammit. I'm dying from a disease that only cure is a kiss from you. No, what the fuck? Fucking pedo alert. Jesus Christ. You should... Why? <laughs> I mean, the door was clearly open, so, like, why shouldn't I just come in here? Well, I guess you're right. I mean, there's a guy with a Pidgeot. A guy with a fossil who's told to get rid of it, yet he won't give it to me. And then a fucking pedophile who's trying to hit on me. So, you know. Alright. Okay, let's see. Is there anything actually interesting in here? Hey, I'm a security guard here. No one can steal anything as long as I'm on duty. Well, that's what you think. I love looking at fossils. They kind of remind me of me. No. Oh. Haha, <laughs> because you're old. Alright. Daddy, I want a magmar for a pet. <laughs> fucking Jesus. <laughs> fucking magmar. Does it have to... Does does it has to be a... Does it have to be a magmar? Not has. Is this guy's first fucking language not English or something? One day I'm going to start a team called Team Galactic. Ha ha ha. Is that you, Cyrus? Probably not. Alright, well that, that was a waste of money and just totally fucking pointless in every way. Alright, well... Let's go to the mart, I guess, see what's going on in here. What can I buy? Can I buy... Repels? I still can't buy repels. God fucking damn it. Alright, well, I'll buy a bunch of potions, I guess. Don't know if I want to buy revives. I don't have a shit ton of money, though. Buy some Pokeballs, I guess. Even though it seems like every Pokemon I come across, I just capture without having to use a Pokeball. Uh... Fuck it, might as well buy some revives. Why not? You never know. I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Ah, the classic line of a youngster. Alright. So who are you three? You wanna what? Not really, no. Leave us alone. We're not props. I am Brittany. Who are you? What are you looking at? Stay away from me. Clear? I mean, god damn. Alright, I guess I'll watch the dance. Unholy Trinity would only means... Wait. Would only means heartbreak for me? What does that even mean? Would only mean... What the fuck are you talking about? No, that was just fucking shit. <laughs> God damn. What a fucking waste of time that was. I'm trying to enroll my son into the best school in Kanto. I don't want him to live a life of a loser like me. No. Oh. I hate how my dad doesn't spend time with me. He has reasons. I mean, I... Did I really have to give my own opinion on that, or what? <laughs> Alright. What do you got to say? I know Machoke is a Pokemon, but don't you think they look sexy? Oh my fucking god. Yeah, you need to fucking chill out. 
Jesus Christ. This guy's got some weird stuff in his game. I'm very curious. I'm pretty sure that's probably not in the fucking manga though. My husband has been experiencing pain lately. I'm scared that he's at his limit. Oh, well. I think I'm going to leave this world soon. I really don't want to leave my wife. Well, that's fucking depressing. Thanks for that. <laughs> what are you go? What are you two saying? Sorry, this area is off limits. Okay. Is that blue? You! You're taking it easy, aren't you, Ridge? You're slow. You'll never get the Pokedex filled by playing around like that. I'm embarrassed to have you as my rival in this quest. What was that? You want to fight? Come to think of it, we never got to finish our battle back in... I'm pretty sure I kicked the shit out of you in Viridian Forest, but whatever. But first, my impetuous friend, allow me to let you in on something. This town gym leader is looking for someone competent to fight. To fight him, I intend to do so and win the Boulder Badge. Boulder Badge? Don't you know, the Boulder Badge can boost the attack power of your Pokemon. Every trainer knows that. Well, sorry. Here's my challenge. Let's see which one of us can win the Boulder Badge first. Of course, it shouldn't be much of a chat, a match. Ha ha ha. I'll take on that challenge. You'll regret it. Ha. One. Oh, and one more thing. Pewter City Gym Leader uses Rock type Pokemon. Your Poliwhirl and Bulbasaur should have no problem handling handling that. Yeah, you're damn right. I'm actually curious. Like, if I if I didn't take Bulbasaur, would he still say that? If I like just put him in the PC and never used them. Hmm. Very curious. All right. Well, let's see. Uh, yes. Oh, it's a tournament? Interesting. That's kind of strange. Can I just... What do I do? I'm small, but I am powerful. I won't go easy on you, kid. Haha, <laughs> what's wrong? Are you afraid? I'm old, but I'm strong. My bot... Oh my god. Is that you, fucking Reggie? Who is she? She's kind of cute. Oh, that's, uh... That's blue. Excuse me, creep. Can you stop staying? Oh, fuck you. Really? Why is it every female and then she talked to her like that? You're a creep, stop looking at me. Like, Jesus Christ. Hey, I, I am pumped for this tournament. People always call me fat and useless. If I win this, I can finally prove to myself that I'm not useless. Same man. Fucking feel your pain. <laughs> We're Brock's guards. Don't come any closer. Okay. I can only fight worthy opponents. Show me your worth by winning my competition. Okay, well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? How do I start? Well, what the f How do I start the tournament? Hello? Um... How do I start the tournament? I'm kinda confused. I'm, I'm so confused. How the fuck do I start the tournament? I've literally spoke to everybody I can speak to. Do I am, I am I seriously just to wait like this? I'm really confused. What's what is happening? What? I mean, seriously, I'm. Am I supposed to be doing something right now or what? Nothing is happening. I ca literally can't get out of here. Okay. I'm just gonna wait and try and figure out what the hell to do, and then I'll probably cut to that moment, guys. So bear with me. All right, so we're back. Apparently, see me uh, over in the left side there, just above the green guy? Apparently I was just to stand there. Like, god fucking damn. I mean, considering the guy literally put me in that position and then said, just stand here. Like, I feel a little dumb for not figuring it out, but at the same time, really, like that's just, really, <laughs> god damn. All right, first battle will be between Red and Elder Kyle. All right, bring it on, Elder Kyle. Back in the day, I was known as Dynamite Kyle. <laughs> well, you're fucking old as shit now, and I'm gonna kick your ass. Alright, what do you got? Sandshrew. Ha. Easy. Okay. Maybe not as easy as I thought. Let's just... There we go. Hey, and a brewer is probably gonna evolve. A Vulpix. Ew. Let's, uh... Switch to Omi, shall we? And just use a couple of water up. Okay. Uh, screw it. That'll, that'll do. 
You have one. Well, you only did like one thing. <laughs> Yay! A few matches later. Okay, me and. Now let's begin round two. Red. For the first match, Red versus Camper Lane. Haha, <laughs> are you ready? Bring it on. Alright. Oh, Arata, how scary. Wow, that bite actually done. Wow! Really? That done way too much fucking damage. What the fuck? Jesus Christ, why is this Rata so fucking powerful? God damn. Alright, screw you. Can I heal my Pokemon at some point or what? Ah, oh, oh well. Uh, I get- I'm kind of scared. Like, I- my Pokemon are a bit fucked, unless, like, they automatically get healed. Alright. What? That's not fair. Wait, what did they say there? Silence! If only- if you ha- if- era, if any of you have a, any problem, then the way I run my own tournament, then the door is just right over there. No one is going to stop you from leaving. Huh. I- I'm not- I totally missed what he said. Sniff, sniff. What's wrong? I really need to win this tournament so I can get the prize money to help pay for my mother's surgery. <laughs> Forget I've said that. Let's just battle. No, you, you need to win the tournament more than me. Red, what the hell are you doing? She needs the prize money. You're embarrassing this tournament. You're embarrassing. This tournament doesn't offer any prize money. Huh? You lied to me. So what if I did? I, I, yeah, I kind of... I mean, it was kind of easy to determine that that's what she was fucking doing. God damn. Alright, green. She knows. Wait, she has. Do you only, how does she only have a Jigglypuff? Didn't she steal a Squirtle from Professor Oak? I'm pretty sure she did. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna put this thing to sleep so that I can use uh, a bunch of healing items because holy shit, my Pokemon are fucking just. Yeah. Really need to heal up, so let's uh, do that, shall we? Luckily, I bought a shit ton of potions and stuff, so. Oh. Back to sleep. No, nope. I ah for fuck's sake. All right, well let's just heal up Bulbasaur, and then I'll just knock this thing out, or at least try to. Oh, go back to sleep. There we go. Potion. There we go. That should be that should be fine. Uh, let's just. Hmm. God damn it. All right, that was lucky, Ellie. Like, I got the stupid attract. Uh, status on me, but double slap done enough damage to just knock him out. You have won. Yay! Now I just have to fight Baloo, I think. We have a winner! Lion will get you nowhere. Hmm. Lies. Li uh, lies have got me this far. Finally, someone who's worthy. A few matches later. Round three's over. Now the gym leader will select the worthy challenger. So I don't, I don't even get to fight Blue. Red from Pallet Town, you are worthy enough to face me for the boulder badge. Haha! -ha. Get it up, me. I'll give you a few moments to get ready. Okay, awesome. Well, at least it lets me like come here and heal. <laughs> and now I can just uh, head up there. Yay, and get my first badge, finally. Awesome. So is it just going to be me and him in here? Oh, <laughs> oh fucking yeah. Except uh, Blue and Green are both pissed off probably because they were upset. I have been waiting for a worthy challenger for so long. Now, let's sp spice this battle up. Onyx Sandstorm. Well, that's kind of bullshit. <laughs> like, how does he get to do that? Like, he's just like, oh, I get a free move before the battle even starts. Haha. <laughs> that's bullshit, Brock. Bullshit. All right, well, we got our first uh, gym battle. Yeah. All right, first up is Geodude. That should be fine. I mean, that's kind of bullshit that he gets to use Sandstorm, because now his Pokemon are going to be... I'm not going to die as easily against my special attacks. Yep. Normally that would have fucked him up, but I think the Sandstorm has saved his ass. And that rock throw, holy shit, that rock throw done a shit ton of damage. Also, want to point out, why the fuck has Bulbasaur not evolved? Pretty sure he evolves in level 16. So, what the hell? Unless this guy's changed it, which I'm assuming he probably did by the looks of it. Oh well. Would have made this fight a lot easier if he actually evolved the level he's supposed to. Don't know why the guy decided to change that, it's kind of weird. But, oh well. Whatever. 
All right, well, we got to level 17, so that's pretty cute. He's got another geo, so he's got he's just got two geo dudes, I guess, and then his onyx. Wait, geo dudes? What the fuck? All right, how is how is this okay? Three against one, like what the fuck? This is horse shit. This is bullshit. There's three geo dudes. What the fuck? That's such what the fuck? How is that even fair? So what how does how does this work? Does, does is it literally like the stats of three geo dudes at once or what? Like how the fuck does this even work? I'm so confused. Uh, must be. Holy shit. How the fuck is this even fair? How he gets to use three Pokemon at once. I call bullshit. Brock is a cheating motherfucker. Yeah, well, critical hit. Suck on that, you bitch. How did I get less XP for that when it was three Geodos? <laughs> what the fuck? Alright, now he's got- holy shit, his Onyx is at level 20. Alright, see, I feel like I'm definitely very underleveled now, because holy shit. Uh, can I hypnosis him? Thank god. To make this fight a lot easier. Alright. Hopefully a cut. hopefully a cap- a couple of water guns will be enough to take this thing out. Hopefully it doesn't wake up before then, because I feel like this thing's going to really be able to do a lot of damage. I oh, thank god. <sighs> Alright, we have won the fight, unless unless I'm lucky and he somehow goes first, which uh, hopefully that's not the case. Yeah, I was, I was just thinking there, I mean, knowing my luck, it'd be like, oh, it was actually a speed tie, now he gets to go first and he fucking just destroys you. But yeah, we got our first gym badge. Fucking nice. That was a lot tougher than I thought it was going to be. Like, holy shit. Considering I had a water and grass type to start with, fighting Brock should not have been that goddamn difficult. No way. I mean, you're a bit of a cheating fuck, Brock. You used Sandstorm before the fight even started. And you fucking used three Geo dudes at once. You're a cheating son of a bitch. What happened? Did Brock lose? You have defeated me. I shall reward you the boulder badge. I've got the boulder badge. Hey, yeah. Boulder badge, the boulder badge strength, strengthens your Pokemon's attack. Take this as well, it may help you in your journey. Team 39. What is that, Rock Tomb? Hey, fucking nice. Alright. So, uh, let's see, what do I... God, my Pokemon got fucked up. Alright, uh, so what was the TM he gave me? Yeah, it was Rock Tomb. Oh my god. Oh, it gives, you get 10 of every TM that you pick up? That's pretty cool. So it's not... It's not unlimited use, but you get a few uses out of it. Alright, that's cool. Um, so I guess that's that's going to be the end of this episode, I guess, guys. Uh, I'm going to just go heal up. And, uh, yeah. So next time, I guess we're just going to head towards Mount Moon, I guess, is the next thing we have to do. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.